Hello guys, my name's Mikey and I'm going to be doing a Discover God with you today. Um, and so the first thing I want you guys to do is, before we start the Discover God, is make sure you have two things. The first is a Bible and the second is a nice quiet place so you can focus on what the Bible is saying. Um, so we're going to be looking at a passage from Luke, but before we read it, I'm going to pray for us. Father God, I pray that you help us understand what God's saying to us today, and that we can become more like your son Jesus and love him even more. Amen. So, I'm going to read Luke chapter 1, verses 1 to 4. Many have undertaken to draw up an account of the things that have been fulfilled among us just as they were handed down to us by those who were from the first were eyewitnesses and servants of the word. With this in mind, since I myself have carefully investigated everything from the beginning, I too decided to write an orderly account for you, most excellent Theophilus, so that you may know the certainty of the things you have been taught. Great. So, Luke researched a lot about what Jesus did. And he was sure what he was writing was reliable. But my first question to you is, how can we be sure too that what Luke has written is reliable? And you want to be looking at verses 1 to 3. So I'm going to give you some time to do that now. If you want to pause the video, look through those verses and see what you can come up with. So, three things that can help us be sure that what Luke has written is reliable. The first one is in verse 1, and it says, Many have undertaken to draw up an account of the things that have been fulfilled among us. And what that's saying is Luke has read the accounts from other people about the life of Jesus, has read them and researched them, and he knows them himself. The second is the eyewitnesses that he talks about in verse 2. He's spoken to the people who saw Jesus and saw every amazing thing that he did. So he's got the information from them. And then thirdly, in verse 3, Luke says that he carefully investigates everything from the beginning. So he looks at what people have written, he looks at what people have said about him and the eyewitnesses, and then he himself carefully investigates all that research and creates this orderly account that he's talking about in verse 3 as well and so we can trust in what Luke has said there because of the three things that he's done with the looking at the accounts looking at the eyewitnesses and carefully investigating himself so that he can make this orderly account so with that in mind I'd like to ask you a second question and that is knowing that the book of Luke and that story of Jesus is accurate, how does that change how we um, think and act towards God and the Bible? Great. And for me, that means that um, we accept the truth that Jesus really did die and rise again um, so we could be friends with God again. He takes our sin on the cross, he dies with it, he rises again. If we trust in him, we can have a relationship with God as well. And that's what it changes for me. Thanks, guys.